have you always uh, been a believer in this like talk shit get hit mentality? Um, there's been a lot of conversation. I know we're kind of tiptoeing around the topic a little bit right now, but uh, Will Smith. Yeah. Uh, Ti got on stage with a with a comedian yesterday who had some shit to say about him in in, in the audience, and he got up and took the mic. Um, what? Where, yeah, oh, shit, yeah, and, and said some shit to her. It was light. Where do you? It was, it was light. Where Where do you think? Uh, do, do you think there's a line that is drawn, and and you could answer this however you want for for people that talk shit as a way to drive entertainment content and viewership? Man, I think that line varies from everything. You know, like from comedians, right? Their line's gonna be different, maybe than like two scientists that work together, something like that. I think there's gonna be lines in all fields, but lines that you just don't cross is, I don't care how much I dislike any of you, I'm not gonna talk about none of your moms, your kids, I don't care about your significant other. If my problem's with you, then you, I come at, you know? And then and in there, and especially in sports, right? Like whether it's two football players that are on the line and they're just talking shit to each other to get in, inside each other's heads, it's it's part of sports, you know? I Like I don't mind shit talking at all to me or about me or anything like that, you know? I. Uh, I definitely think there has to be some lines drawn because if not, it just it'll just keep going and going. And when you're involving other people, like if I was to say something about your wife, let's say, and then you get home and then you have to answer to your wife, I'm putting you in a fucked up spot for no reason, you know. So things that like but that's, that, that's, I don't agree. But that's the name of the game. That's, that's the name that's, of the that's game. That's why they do it. Like yeah. like I remember uh, uh, in, in a couple of my back and forths with KSI. He, he would bring up my girl at the uh -huh. time and then it would cause rifts uh -huh. between us uh -huh. in, in real life, which is like the worst. But, but that's not professional, right? Because that's on your personal. So then if you one day see KSI and you're like, yo, what's all that shit you were talking about? It's no longer professional. It's back to the personal. Uh, they did it. Uh, that's uh, how uh, I feel. Okay, so like okay. we fix it, you know, you, you, you keep it. We keep it either professional or we don't, you know. And though I come from an environment that's way different than what the pro fighting is like, I've always kept the pro pro. I've, I don't have any points for even like following somebody because I try to fight as clean as possible. I, I don't bring any of those street elements with me ever into like a prize fight combat. But if people so choose to do it, that that's on them, you know. And, and of course, you could do whatever you want, but there's got to be some type of consequences, right? So there, did you think it was out of pocket for Will Smith to smack, or do you think I was like, okay? Um, yeah, in that specific circumstance, what did you what did you think of that <laughs> that situation? <laughs> Because of some current situations, I'm going to plead the fifth right now. Yeah, got it. <laughs> what, what kind of current, what kind of current situations? Uh, some situation I won't even mention right now, but I, you know, I'm, I'm for the Will Smith thing. I'm going to say, I, I don't know. The only thing I found that it was funny is that he laughed originally. Then he looked at it. <laughs> then he looked at his chick and she gave him the go ahead. Like dog, you better not be laughing. He was like, Shh, you know, you so that, that was hilarious to me, man. But I mean, to each his own, how everybody chooses to handle their business, that that's theirs, you know? I mean, I know she's going through her thing. She's got like alopecia, I think. Yeah, so yeah, I, yeah. I could see why he'd be a. Uh, but the, the internet is unforgivable, bro. Yeah. They pull and out undefeated. all the stuff. <laughs> they have clips of her being like, I don't even care about people talking about my hair. And they have all these times of him saying, like, uh, he, he like this. Uh, my favorite is the Will Smith one in Fresh Prince, where he's like laughing and his girlfriend's like looking at him like yeah, this. Yeah, 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 yeah. And he goes, <laughs> and it's like all that. And, dude, I go, how do they find this shit? Everything. Or Everything. they remade a SpongeBob episode where he's on stage taught. Oh my, I lost it. Yeah. The internet won in every single situation. Like always this, does. It always wins. Okay, I don't know if you're allowed to talk about this. Oh god. But what is your favorite off like market fight? Like I'm talking like you're at a Taco Bell and this guy's like chirping at you and you're like. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. The spit and the slap is a good one. Have you ever caught it in the air while it hits the face like, and time it right? And just no <laughs> man, no. But I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna have to steal that one, bro. It's a pretty good one, bro. Um, for for you know, Miami, it's famous for for the slapping as well. And uh, it's disrespectful, bro. To get slapped. Right. And in the Latin community, it's like the worst. Dude, that and like, a finger in your face. You put a finger in my face, yeah, I'm biting that shit off. Yeah, fingers. Only yeah. my dad could put his finger in my face. I like the the, I was, you know, I like the slap because it also gives you a chance to assess the situation. Be like, oh, you want to keep going? And, <laughs> and if I'm doing it right, I'm gonna get a little bit of finger in your ear, so you get that beep. Yeah. They, you uh, can't really talk to him afterwards because then you're like <laughs> exactly yeah they can't hear shit and then you, you're you giving them time to like do you want to keep going or yeah. are you good with that slap and then everything's going to be fine well because so. there's two different there's two people there's one that will take it and go back to dinner and be like wow that sucks and then the other one <laughs> there's the Chris Rocks yeah exa exactly 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 oh you got to kill me man <laughs> <laughs> you got you got to kill just you got to kill me have you, you ever been smacked have you ever been smacked oh yeah yeah 
been slapped by chicks, by dudes, and fucking, you know. And um, chicks are the worst because, like, what the fuck do you do at this point? <laughs> no, nah, yeah. I think it's kind of cool, actually. I think it's kind of cool. Restrain. I, I carefully restrain. Wait, if, you think if it's needed. cool when you get smacked by a girl? If I deserve it, yeah. And sometimes, and most times, I probably deserve it. I'm sorry for my man, bro. I don't know <laughs> what does that even mean. Well, how do you uh, how do you deserve a smack can, in the I face? I can be a fucking yeah, difficult, bro. I can I can be shit. difficult, bro. And it's better than closing a fist and being assaulted by a, a girl you like. But like a little smack, like yo, get your ass in check, boy. But sometimes us men need to be fucking handled. I don't know. Maybe maybe I'm, 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 I've never really been smacked I'm by with anybody. By a girl. I think it. I think it depends on the situation. Like you have those like slap happy girls. Oh yeah. Where, no, like, that's not where cool like you end up in a situation like where you come back with like she said a six piece nugget, you get a four, <laughs> and she, and it's like. You know what I'm saying? And you're just like, oh, okay, yeah, we're done. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. <laughs> yeah, that ain't gonna fucking I, I, happen. <laughs> they do it with the choking sometimes too, where they're like unconscious, and then you stop, and they're like, "Why'd you stop?" You you're can't like, tell if they're coming or dying. Yeah, you're like, "Yo, dog, you're blue. you're blue. Why do you? Like, what are you talking?" <laughs> the leg like, twitches. <laughs> and then I you feel like, like, no, 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 and then they bring your hand back. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> No more coffee. No more coffee. He's, he's, he's got some coffee. It's a pleasure meeting you, man. <laughs> <laughs> you can't get that on any other program. You can't get that on any other program. <laughs> yeah, so Brazilians. Yeah. How much is a Brazilian? I don't know how much it costs. I didn't pay for it. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> the Brazilian butt lift? BBLs, baby. Oh, those are it. A lot of those in Miami. Those are yeah. A lot of those in Miami. Yeah. Is that the one that looks kind of natural? Yeah, that's the real one. It's not the one that that's like a, a rock in there. That's the that's the one that one of one of them's legal, one of them's illegal. So the one that is Actually, feels really firm and it's hard. That's the legal one. The any kind of injectable liquids. Obviously, I know about this stuff to an extent. <laughs> to like a <laughs> tea, bro. Any kind of, I believe, any kind of injectable liquids, they have to go to places like Brazil or Pan, okay. like wherever for it. And because they leak. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, there have been some fatalities. Oh, 100%. Been some serious fatalities. Like real fame, yeah, actual yeah. famous people that yeah, have died yeah, getting bad. BBLs 100% because yeah. that shit leaks and it's very, po very poisonous. How did we get here? How the fuck did I we get I don't know, here? but within the 30 seconds, I choked myself out, threw myself back. <laughs> that was the best. Came back, and then we talked about leaking on ourselves. And I love that you giggled to yourself. <laughs> he said leak, and he's like, 